Hi friends, today we can learn how to create good assessment tools, online assessment tools. There are a large number of online assessment tools are there, but I think among which the one of the interesting application is Qsys.com. Qsys. We can just search for that application. Q U I Z I Z Z. Qsys. And this is the platform where we can create it. It's as a game. We can join or we can play the questions. And just cl uh, click on that link. Here, what is our advantage for students is that they can directly search for a topic and they can uh, play that uh, topic for example find a quiz in biology this is only for students but the, actually this uh, is useful for teachers that I will explain later now the student will take a topic of 10 question and for uh, just for fun he can learn using this questions or they can uh, play with their friends just introduce the uh, site for your students they will um, learn themselves but this is not the use for teachers for teachers uh, they have to do one thing they have to create an account by clicking here just clicking here uh, create an account by uh, signing up uh, for signing up you need only three things uh, either you can directly sign with Google but never share the Google account with another platforms uh, you can use another Google account an, an unofficial Google account uh, for that purpose uh, then uh, use that account only to use such uh, platforms like Qsys, Kahoot, Mentimeter all other platforms you can use because uh, while signing up with Google, you give permission for QCIS to access your Google Drive, Google uh, Apps, etc. Otherwise, you can use for another method, use another email ID and its password. Uh, never share your original email ID for these platforms. Okay, then after uh, giving your email ID, click next, where you are asked with some questions like, uh, which is the level of your class you give just higher education if you are in college or you can give secondary higher secondary etc then uh, you may be asked your uh, uh, subjects such things can be given here uh, i will try to create but uh, actually my uh, that i email id may be utilized uh, that's why i cannot uh, sure uh, I can share this uh, actually there is an error that uh, capital letters okay and I created this email ID for only for that purpose okay now account is already exist so I now go for login now uh, this is my login credential I just click on uh, login then this is a platform where I have created many quizzes. See, these are the quizzes I already created. Now I can create a new quiz by clicking here or clicking here. And it is an easy step to create quizzes. Just click the create quiz button and click name this quiz. I can give the name um, test kusat okay just give the name and select the level this is the level I have already given during my uh, sign up time okay I just click education professional development and clicks next now I can ask some questions there are different types of questions multiple choice checkbox fill in the blanks poll open-ended like that here I click on multiple choice here I can ask questions here and it will be displayed here as it is displayed in a mobile phone. Here this is my first question. Mm, who is the prime 
मिनिस्टर ऑफ इंडिया ओके ए सिंपल क्वेश्चन एंड हियर आई ट्राई टू टाइप द आंसर नरेंद्र मोदी राइट हियर राहुल गांधी हियर सोनिया गांधी हियर पिनराई विजय yeah now select the correct answer from this list that means uh, the tool no, now no uh, which is a correct answer and what is advantage of this platform you can use image file as well as audio file to uh, part to become a part of the question text that means uh, you can play a bit of music and using that music you can ask some question identify the sound in that way or you can add some image and uh, you can ask identify this person and here another option for to add math formulas uh, with with the uh, help of that um, platform you can create equations to ask some questions okay then you can set the time limit for the test uh, from 5 seconds to 5 minutes okay i select 20 second to answer this question and click on save button and this is the appearance of that question and this is only one question here i add uh, for this topic and it as it is named as test quiz hat uh, it will not uh, lead to um, general questions yet i will try to teleport question this is an another easy way to create question okay uh, for the purpose i just click teleport here i have i can search for questions related to this area indian politics yeah i search for this topic and there are number of questions available here and from their question i can add questions to my question paper the members of rajya sabha are elected uh, uh, elected by elected members of the legislature elected members rajya sabha in that way the question is there i just click add that means that question will be added to my question paper then that is only question selected from there and i go for another um, indian politics notes check here the first indian empire was led by one question is there i just click on this see what happens to my question paper this is a first question created by me these two questions are teleported okay that way uh, that is the easiest method of using teleport now click on done button that's all the question is clear now i can add one image as a title of this um, question paper uh, i can directly add it from uh, my computer okay i add one uh, peacock figure here then uh, the language it is in english then i select the grade of this question university to professional development it is higher level question then this is the important area make it public or private i make it public then select save okay that's only we need to create this question then now this question is ready to play now there are three methods of uh, assigning this question to students one is play live play live means yeah play live play live means um, you can uh, play simultaneously with the student when when you click on this play live the student should be uh, at the same time arranged online and the question will be sent in one way or other to them and they can play simultaneously okay then assign homework means you can send a link of this question to students they can sit in their home at their own time they can answer 
okay then third is a just for a practice just you just give uh, the question code to students they can practice by um, watching the answer i here like to play play live now i will demonstrate how to play live and in play live there are three methods one is team method team means uh, a team and b team okay in uh, live class you can divide your class into two groups in online mode also you can divide and group the students and assign teamwork and the this is the most popular one is classic mode in classic mode it plays as a game and in this classic mode the students are uh, um, students can get some compliments while uh, answering some three consecutive questions they may they may be awarded some gifts as bonus points okay the test this is a serious one if you conduct an internal examination via this application it is possible and uh, for that purpose you have to select this test uh, then um, you can use it as a serious examination now i play with classic mode then assigning to class is optional there is such options you can set classes here and you can assess uh, you can assign uh the question to class such are uh, um, advanced things are there but don't go for, go for that uh, just click classic and play continue that's all yeah now share this address and this code with your students that is only thing the students need to access your question i will demonstrate i just copy this address and play it in an incognito window here i will uh, paste the address here the students are asked to provide uh, see uh, consider this is the window of a student okay this is a window of a student and this is a window of the teacher this is a window of the teacher and this is a window of the student okay now you got the idea now i uh, copy this uh number and paste it here okay student will uh, go there and give this code just click on join then what will happen the student uh, have to give a name okay uh, her name is jodi just give one name jodi okay right jodi and i click start game now what happen is that jyoti will appear here in that way any number of any number of students can play then this student now waiting to start the game by the teacher because it is live game now i click start button then the questions will be displayed here a countdown will appear now the question will be appeared here see the question is here the seconds the 20 second time is here see 20 second time is going on and here in teachers view these are the teachers view okay fine now i click on this okay now submit and it is a wrong answer see i have no point is your teach one uh, complement will appear zero points then this is the question created by me that is the order of the question will be shuffled by the system now i select narendra mode yeah it's a right answer okay congrats 800 points now this is the uh, third question the first indian empire was led by i select chandragupta maurya i don't know whether it is correct yeah it is correct now the game is over uh, then the result will be displayed one more question is uh, this is a game bonus point for me uh, rajya sabha is selected by uh, members of lok sabha i select and click on submit again it is a wrong answer i get stuck on this one yeah that question is wrong now the game ended Uh, find a new quiz. Okay, that's for student. That what teachers view is that uh, this is the first person. Then here I also I can 
get the answer one two incorrect two correct question and one incorrect question then time to for answering per question is there in that way i can self analyze uh, the teacher can analyze this much details jodi got uh, this much percentage score and uh, uh, among the questions which all the questions made uh, incorrect such things are also visible for teacher then teacher also got another one chance that teacher can uh, store this data okay i will show after ending this demonstration i just click exit and here uh, i just close this window uh, here in reports in the uh, reports menu there is a new item test qsat i just click here to show the result and here i can download it in the form of an excel sheet that means all the past playing of uh, your qsat will be available in the reports and you can download it at any time okay then uh, what is the uh, what is available inside the Uh, report that also i can demonstrate just open it uh, you can also compare it with the google form but google form consists of many other things but it is not so uh, so game mode as in in the case of this quizzes and uh, uh, similar to this quizzes there is another application and its name is kahoot uh the all the structures are almost same uh for this kahoot and both these platform share some similarities and both the platforms have uh, mobile applications too okay uh, they are some so some way or other competitors so uh, you can either go for qsis or uh, you can go for either qsis or go for kahoot kahoot is more good for little children because it is more colorful i think um, um college students may like qsis because it is simple in layout okay then the downloader result i will show the downloader result this is the download result of qsis test qsat here the right question is the uh, then a total point is the then player level result is there the jodi got this much point all the students will listed in this way and that's all about this um qsis you uh, can practice both qsis as well as kahoot thank you for watching